<laughs> Which, <laughs> the, t- just tell me a bit about them, <laughs> if you can. I'm sorry to put you on the spot. Yeah, <laughs> I feel put on the spot. Yeah. No, I've just collected stuff that's been around the house that I and put them into collage. That's all. Oh, beautiful. Yeah. Yeah, it was a very messy page, and then just by putting that one over, I it kind that. of calmed it down a bit. Mm, so I think I can see layers upon layers. Which, which page oh, so do you particularly page love? Page. I, I, yeah, I think that's quite interesting, because I didn't I didn't like it, but then just by putting mm. that... Mm. I, that I love that messy... Card, that is stunning, mm. yeah. And I like tearing as well. Yeah. So that really works. How about you, Sue? Which page you, uh, which is sort of reaching out to you? Well, today's ones, I suppose that that one mm. somehow. <laughs> yeah, I was completely stuck when I started it, and it you know there's not much of it really, but it's lovely. That's standing out, and that 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 steampunk one is with the things you added on. That that was standing out really well. Well done, brilliant. Sorry to put you on the stop, guys. No, no. Hello. 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 <laughs> Gosh. Can you just tell me a bit about what you you put your pages out, what you've been doing? Me? Yeah, please. Oh. Playing with paint. <laughs> just playing with paint. <laughs> playing with paint. <laughs> Having great fun. Having great fun. This is lovely. Is this sort of, is that like a midnight mystical forest or? <laughs> yes, I suppose. It just, it just happened. I, I don't know why. I just like the bronze and I like the purple. Yeah. And it just grew. It really works, doesn't it? And um, now I found out that by accident, with my leftover bag, with the things in under, it makes pretty patterns. It's lovely stuff, and you put all those. Oh yeah, I love those. Uh, this yes, was, yeah. This was my table protector. <laughs> Joe. <laughs> Could you flip it over and let's see the other side? So, what what was your inspiration for that? Um, I just start, I knew that I wanted to start with some of the yellow tissue underneath, and I knew I wanted it to be darker above it. And you that was so as much as I knew to start with, and as it came on, it's kind of become the universe. <laughs> this is my whole universe <laughs> in a folder. <laughs> it's what what holds everything? Well, yeah. Universe, then. So. It's amazing. And are you, are you going to? Do you think you'll continue with the journaling and put some more? Ah, because you write anyway. Yes, yeah. Has yeah. yeah. it, it changed? Because you you sort of wrote in a journal anyway. Is is are you still going to do that method, or are you going to sort of? I'll be doing that because that's a different process. That's the that's complete brain dumping, and it's a habit that I've trained myself into, and I don't want to yeah. break. But. Um, I think there's a reasonable chance that I will start doing, as well as doing the doing my art, that I'll be doing bits like this as a just. Uh, yeah. You know what? Actually, it's time to do a bit more of this. Is is there like a preferred technique that you've sort of come across here, or something that you've sort of rediscovered? Ooh. Um. I'd say of the four weeks, the thing that stands out most of actual technique would be the fact that I always had a bit of a bias against watercolour. Ah. Because watercolours were always pretty little tweed for paintings that come yeah, inside yeah. they're all neat and controlled and they're lovely. They're really lovely in their place and they're nothing to do with yeah. me. <laughs> Whereas the playing we did with watercolours yeah. was fun. <laughs> and was exactly the kind of thing that And they do make I a lovely really backdrop, enjoy. don't they, to writing. If you just sort of throw up yeah. Just let a wash run across a page and do oh, what it wants, and then yeah. it dry, and then you can write on it. And, and the blowing, the blowing the stuff with the straws. I love that. Really I fun. love that. Yeah, that, that's really that's good. So you you find it sort of helped a bit. Uh, obviously, I've got to go back to recovery, Devon, and tell them people have enjoyed it. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah. That's good. Sue. Hello. That's, that's lovely. Uh, well, can you just tell me a little bit about your technique that you're putting it, how you're putting it together? I don't know really. <laughs> stab it until it obeys. My technique is I don't know, and I find out as I'm going along. Oh right, okay, fair enough. <laughs> um, this is my operating manual. Yeah. Because I realised looking at some of the websites on complex PTSD that I'm not alone, and that a lot of people have kind of things going on for them in their minds and their bodies yeah. as a result of trauma. So. 
we all operate in similar ways and I thought I was on my own so it's been really good for me to realise... Yeah, you said you found a link last yeah, night. That is amazing. I found websites and... All sorts you didn't know they were there? Things like the way I see and things happen in my body. I just thought it was me and there are millions of us more than us. So I've realised that it's not peculiar to me. Anybody who's been through what I've been through would operate in this way and so this is my operating manual. Oh, that's <laughs> wonderful, wonderful. That's good. Um, no, it isn't. Oh, got Carrie, it's like can you just flick through your pages yes. for us and then show us your cover and everything like that? So <laughs> just kind of... right. <laughs> that was my very first thing. <laughs> that was the first was that the first, day. Was that the first thing um, we did? Yeah, and that was just thoughts of at that that day, and that was. I'm looking at this. I can't remember all the things that it was. <laughs> um, that's because I bought a top for the wedding I'm going to. That was my dog that were waking me up at night. Um, that's just love for everybody. Uh, that was a tree that's in my garden that was planted in memory of my mum, which was in beautiful bloom when we first started. And that was the first day I came here because I couldn't find the place. And I went, oh, oh, that's the room. <laughs> <laughs> um, <laughs> you were very good, but I was, yeah, I was yeah, still yeah, rubbish. Yeah, yeah. Um, yeah so that, yeah, that was so lovely. That's lovely. I didn't really know what I was doing. Yeah. And then, oh, what's that one? That's the one you asked us to do pictures, flowers, and that. Yeah. And I felt, again, I felt really stuck because I was just doing old stuff and not very well either. Um, and then I took it home and I just wrote things around it, like that I was uninspired and frustrated, and they were flat and they weren't very good. So, so, so I did a similar thing with, with my thing and it drew yeah. it all together. It's yeah. really good. Yeah. I know. It's like how you feel when, when Gina sort of handed out those paints and just said, mm. do what you like. Yeah. I, I just like, went oh. into automatic pilot of what I've always done. Like yeah. I draw a flower, yeah. I yeah. draw a face yeah. and I don't know what else to do. You do, don't you? And this, yeah. this is what's nice about being this. It's made us think outside yeah. what you normally do. And actually it was actually yeah. quite a struggle because being told, I actually realised that I have a very limited repertoire of things and when I'm, when I'm being asked to be creative I can't yeah. be. But that's why it's nice it stretched us isn't it? It stretched us. Yeah it did actually make you think I know, yeah. and I frightened the hell out of some people yeah. but it oh, actually sort of makes you think what. Well, oh it's great. Well, it's like, like yeah. you said, can, what you say, can, can I do what I like in it? I, I think mm. it, yeah. was, it was a gift, it's yours. And I don't know what I like you know? yeah, <laughs> that's why I've come well, here. Yeah. Yeah. Right. <laughs> Tell me what I like yeah. and I'll do it. <laughs> <laughs> you can do what you want with it you know. I like that. That, that, that is fabulous. Oh, that's just yeah. so simple. How did that happen? That was a stamp. <gasps> and that was... That is yeah. stunning. Yeah. That, that would make the most gorgeous. I'm sorry to be trying, but wrapping paper it would make comes to mind. <laughs> yeah. It really gorgeous. Well, actually, there's a, a son of mine getting married, and he might be getting a card with some... But that like is that. fabulous, yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah. I, I do like that. Yeah. I love that crinkle effect. Yeah, that's good. And I did try it inside there again. Oh, lovely. Yeah. So no, it's that's nice. Brilliant. I love yeah, the colours. Nice. I just decided I wouldn't try and blow it here because yeah. I might mess everybody else's up. <laughs> and and that that's just nice. My tape. Just, yeah, just the and tape. I just copied it. Well, I copied it. I had a go at doing the tape as well. Yeah. yeah. Did, did we missed a few pages at the beginning of the first two. Can I just have okay. a look at those? Um, that that, that, that was. That one. Was that, that was the, the wax, wax resist? Yeah. Yeah. That was really yeah. nice. And I that, love that. Again, it was a splatter. Splatter. Then I added one of the stencils as well. Yeah. Afterwards. Well, you've got the hair that, again, that was that's just textural, nice. isn't it? Yeah. Experiment, really. I love that. Yeah. Uh, I love that. Stencil. I know. I love that stencil. Yeah. <gasps> There's so many ways you can use it. And that, yeah. that is yeah, brilliant. To... Do show us, show us what you've been doing today with your right. with your covers. Um, oh, that's my main cover. How did how did that start out? Um, with a blank. Ah, I don't know what to do. <laughs> 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 everywhere and then just moved it about yeah I like movement in things so I yeah moved it around and also I think I said I don't like words and that I was finding no. that quite hard but I've actually typed some out and I'm going to put them You've, throughout that's a great book. thing great. yeah yeah yeah, you know, sometimes yeah. just cutting out other people's words. No, those little yeah. bits of poems I sent from Mary Oliver. I know they're trying, yeah. but you just cut out a few words and think, yeah, yeah stick yeah. them down. That's so fine. yeah, so I picked some that I like and they're going to go throughout. Yeah. <laughs> That, that's good. And what are you doing at the, on the other side at the moment? Because first of all, you did like a loose watercolour. <laughs> yeah, then report. I decided I'd go back to the cling film, which I really enjoyed. Yeah. So I've just squished it together, really. Um, just played. Fantastic. Yeah. I don't want that to be too too much. Yeah. And a few best ones. Good. Um, have you fairly like enjoyed the course? Loved it. Oh, oh, really, really have loved it. Oh, thank you. Really, really good. It's been great. Yeah. It, yeah. Can you sum up why? 
I think it's just the freedom to do what you want. I, I, and again, I think also being somewhere where you've got so many different things and different ideas from other people. Yeah. Isn't it? You're just absorbing it, everything. Yeah, it's great. Really, really good. If you'd been here on your own with nobody yeah. else, just the materials, what would have happened? I would have been stuck. Definitely. You, you definitely need people. Because I know people sometimes yeah. add up to interference, but yeah. in some oh, no, I think it's house. I think it's really good. Yeah. And it's lovely. I just like seeing what everybody else has done as well. It's really yeah. good. Yeah. yeah. No, I think it's been really success. Fascinating that without watching each other the other week, we all came up with very oh, similar yeah. designs. Yeah, didn't we? <laughs> <laughs> Which was quite weird. Yeah. 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 yeah, we all yeah. suddenly yeah. had thoughts going. Of all the processes, uh, did you quite like the foam, the car, the stamping? I love that. I'm definitely going to do more of that. And that is so well. simple and so cheap yeah, to do. Yeah, what about the Notan thing? That's good. That, yeah. that's what, what, what was it about Notan that makes it sort of a but standout thing? You can be stuck in a solid place and you can't mm. see out of it. And this actually physically shows you how you can aerate it and, and the dances that you can do with that. Yeah. Yeah. It's wonderful. It is, especially with your one, because there's like ways into your Notan, aren't there? You've got little... <laughs> ways of getting into it and getting round it and it's, it, I, I found that a really absorbing experience actually I think yeah that's that's your one then <laughs> I wondered where it gone yeah yeah and actually that quite a good. nice way of setting it out is in your page if you do a double page spread and if you manage to do like the black square on one side and the left and then the, the exploded yeah. square on the other it it really sets it out yeah. I, actually I do have some black paper here if anybody wants to do that now um, cut out a square and there's enough to go around there um, it, it actually will show you um, that sort of thing you all like the washi paper didn't you oh yeah yes, yeah. yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yeah, it's like a little girl's right. birthday party yes. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> definitely well we yeah. do an art journey and then tonight we're having sleepovers at the top of your oh yeah. Mr Jarvis <laughs> oh, <my God. laughs> fantastic yeah. Are, are there any things? I mean, please be open with me, and, and and you have been very honest and open with me. What what? This is very much an experimental thing, as you can see from all the videos. It's a very much coming from America, from the states, and that sort of thing. And um, is there anything we I could have you know we could have put more into or left out, or what what made you feel uncomfortable about it? I think I'd just like to have more more of it. Do you know what I mean? Like yeah. if this went on for a year, that'd be fine. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Four weeks is like because I missed the first one. It's just yeah. Like, yeah. Oh, it's going to stop. Yeah. There was was yeah. there anything that like sort of offended you or you thought you know, mm, blank yeah. or? Not at all. Yeah. Well, make you think, but that's about all. Mm. Yeah. I found myself unsettled after the first time. Yeah. I think I said the I found the not knowing what to expect and yeah yeah i went away and went well it's a good exercise for me isn't it then it that, address yeah. any anxiety by by going actually you don't that's actually a very mystical thing yeah i used to teach medieval theology and one of the things really? we use yeah at, at oxford Did you? yes I, I, medieval stuff yeah oh, and one of the th my favorite ones was the clouds of unknowing and to actually spin yourself into a situation where you actually don't know what's happening, what's mm. expected of you, um, is 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 quite interesting. Yeah. In that cloud of it's a mystical yeah. state almost that you go you go into because it's one of confusion. You can end up like hating people and like being really cross and angry and frustrated. But it's actually a good one to work through yeah. because you actually find out what is it I need to know. Do I need do I need to know? Yeah, it was a bit tough though on the first week. Because it's a new venue and we yeah. all knew for each yeah. other. I, I, I agree that I felt pretty muddled after the first week. Yeah. You know, so I wasn't even sure who was teaching us or yeah. what both of your roles No, that's why, that's why we split it. That's why we split yeah. it after that. Because it was too confusing. Yeah. It was a bit confusing. Yeah. I mean, did, did that work better? It's been easier, much easier. Just with one person. I, it could have been not either one of us. It's just that uh, as I was the person who wrote the bid and I, I'm responsible to Recovery Devon, that yeah. they actually said to me, look, I need to be the one running it. Yeah. So that's why but in the second week I, I, I did that. You know, that's Gina right. and I had a chat. I told her that we'd had like some criticism about it. And uh, we, we did that. And it sort of, you, you were okay about that. Oh, and, absolutely. And, yeah. 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 I mean, it is, you only need one teacher. It's, it's too confusing. Yeah. Do oh, uh, facilitators are good. You're, yeah. you know, tea makers. Also, are also when when I was at when I was at school, it used to really hack me off when the teacher at the front. Like, she's told you what to do, and then when you're doing it, she's still 
powering to 